welcome to my crazy crafty life. My name is Delia and today I have a really big Dollar Tree haul. Um, so let's jump into it. The first item I found were these Peep lip balms. This one is strawberry with marshmallow cream. It is not new. They put these out at Easter. Um, they've done these before and they have other flavors. Um, the next item I found was this Irish Wishes and Shamrock Kisses sign. These are also not new, um, but they have lots of mini signs and they are perfect for like tear trays or just mantle decor, whatever you'd like. There's also even a hanger in the back in case you do want to hang it up. Okay. Um, another not new item is this Easter um, garland. It's got all of the bunnies in different colors and really cute like this. This is not new, um, but it's definitely a good one and I was happy to find them. Um, I will mention I went to four different Dollar Trees to find all of these items and there is a lot. <laughs> Another item is this jewel stickers. Those are kind of cute. Good for all kinds of crafts. Um, let's see found some Easter eggs. They had these with the patterns. Really cute. And they had these like iridescent ones, which I really like. And these are not new. They've done them before. Really cute. Um, I found some Easter socks with gnomes. That one says... Hello Spring, really cute. And then I have one holding an Easter egg. And this one's a longer sock, but this one's like an ankle sock. So good for like, if you're wearing sneakers or around the house, whatever you'd like. Um, okay, another item they've brought back is the Happy Easter with the pink truck and the bunny and all of the Easter eggs sticking out. They also have this in a, with a steak for your lawn. Honestly, with it being MDF, I would try to utilize it indoors, but yeah, that was a really cool little find. Another item they've brought back are the carrots. The twine carrots. Really cute. And I saw a lot of different versions of this. They had a garland. They had bigger ones. A whole lot more choices than they even did last year. So something to keep an eye out for because these are really cool to decorate with. All right. I also found this eyeglass cleaner. I mean, this is big and I mean, it's shocking to find it in it at a dollar store for $1.25 because of how big it is. It has the little spray top and it says that it's anti-reflective glass or safe for anti-reflective glass, plastic and polycarbonate lenses and it's 8.45 fluid ounces. That's a lot. This should last quite a while. Okay, another thing I found, they they restocked these. They've had these before, but it's the cross stitch. I got the um, unicorn, but they had like cupcakes and all kinds of stuff. So if you're interested in learning cross stitch, this would be a fun little pickup. Uh, 
Um, another item I found is that um, Dollar Tree is carrying a lot more um, makeup these days. And um, one of the brands they're carrying are e.l.f. And this is the color Classy. They had others, um, but I figured that was more my my vibe. I'm, you know, if, if you see my videos, I'm more of like a lip balm and that's about it kind of person. So, um, but I figured I'd give this a try and just see if I like it. Um, okay. Another thing I found that I was so happy I found because every time I've seen other people haul these or um, I knew it existed, but I've never actually been able to find them. Are these Buffalo Check black and white fabric? Um, so these are like fat quarters. And I always find the navy blue and white, but I could never find the black and white. And I just found a whole bunch. And not only did I find them at one store, but I found them at two. So hopefully you'll be able to find them. I kind of had to dig through. It was kind of sneaky because they put them in boxes and they come in like mixed patterns, these boxes. So if you see fabric, just dig through and hopefully you'll find them because I think that's the, the secret and why I missed them in the past. So just something to keep your eyes open for. All right. I can't believe how many items I found how many different items I found um, I bought one of these pencil case um, holders and these are not new um, but the reason I got it was I'm probably gonna cut this apart and use it in my car um, in my console because I have a section where like you can put you can connect an iPod but I want to be able to like stick the cord in there and also take the cord out and put my iPod in and just make it easier for me to find it and plug it in so it's not such a big um, hassle. So I, I did pick up one of these to try that out. But not only that, you could put items in here and store them in your car um, because it has the little snap. You know, it has a little snap and you can put, you know, tools, all kinds of stuff in here. Or even if you just, you know, needed a pencil case for something in particular, this would probably be good. You could even put glue sticks in here if they were um, short enough to fit, which most glue sticks are. But if you buy the, like the extra long ones, you probably won't be able to use this, but just something else you can use this for besides pencils and pens. Okay, I found more gem stickers, and these are like different shades of pink, and I don't know if you can, how well you can see these, but the facets on the gems are really cool, especially the bigger ones, and you get some clear ones and some light pink and the darker pink, and they had other ones. They had like blue ones and clear ones, I believe. I could be, excuse me, I could be wrong about the clear ones, but... They definitely had blue and pink. All right. I don't even think I'm halfway through this haul. I found so many cool items this week. Um, okay. This I found at one of the checkouts and I thought it was really cool and worth, you know, picking it up to try. But it says, make your own gem stickers. And you can see the person's hand, like, putting gems on the sticker. Um, let's see. I'm going to open it just so you can see what, I'm, what they're talking about. Okay. Yeah, so you get... Okay, so you get, like, all these gems... So like a rainbow colors 
and then you get a bunch of stickers which you can stick the gems on and make them you know sparkly so that's really cool I mean either way you don't have to use the gems on these stickers you could technically you could just use the gems on something else but I thought that was pretty cool and it looks like it's a summer theme so this is really cool and I think they had other ones but this is the one that I liked personally so this is the one I picked up So there's more. Not bad for $1.25. You get a lot for that price. It says there's over 200 stickers or gem stickers and five sticker sheets. So for $1.25, I think that's pretty good. Okay. Um, the next thing I found I picked up because shout out to my mother-in-law um, thank you for this idea this is amazing she um, I don't know where she got the idea I think she, she didn't make it up but she heard it from somebody that you can take your vaccine cards and stick them in in these badge holders because they're like the exact same size so if you want to be able to keep it and not laminate it and keep it safe you can keep it in your wallet and you know you can trim these down and you'll also have the badge holder um, lanyards too for whatever else you'd like and you get five so I mean it, our fam we have we're a family of five so that would work for us but if you have less people or more people you know so yeah, you get these, you get the lanyards, which have like the breakaway cord, which, yeah, breaks away. And then you get the, the pouches too. So if you wanted to just use the lanyards for keys or whatever, you can, and then you have the pouches and you can trim them down if, you know, if you're using it for a vaccine card. You even get like a cardboard in there if you want to keep it extra safe um, but you don't have to keep the poster board or cardboard piece in there it slides right out so up to you <laughs> I thought that was pretty cool and I would probably even keep that because I don't know about you but my vaccine card I don't think there's any more room to add um, any other boosters or anything like that on it so if you kept this maybe they could just write it on there I don't know just a thought but yeah this would be really cool for that and then you'd have lanyards for other things too I mean even if you don't use them as lanyards you could even just use the cords you know they come off pretty easy they're just looped through and then these open so you wouldn't even have to cut them so that's that's good Okay. Um, let's see. Okay, I found these hair ties with the pearls. And I think they had other colors, but the black and the pink were the two that I wanted. And I love Dollar Tree's um, hair accessories. I've never been disappointed by them. I love them and I think they work great. So picked a couple of those up. Then another thing, I could not believe that Dollar Tree is carrying these because I've seen them in stores um, for like at least $4, I want to say. Maybe less, but even still a dollar 25 each is amazing and um, they had other designs but I got the rainbows and they're car coasters so you put them in your car and they kind of um, protect your um, car from getting you know 
dirty and they collect kind of like the moisture and stuff so um, but even still like it's easier to take these out wash them and then plop them back in to the car um, but I really liked the rainbow ones I think they had like a pineapple one I'm pretty sure pineapple and they had one that said good vibes and I think there was another style but I just can't remember what it was but I liked the rainbow so that's the one I picked up all right <laughs> um the one of the last hauls I showed I showed some gnomes that um they had the bigger ones and the smaller ones but I hadn't found the bigger ones with the stars and I found one so <laughs> I picked him up. He's cute. Yeah. So you can paint him however you like. He's got little stars and this is like another layer. Um, his his beard is another layer. Really cute. So yeah. Um, okay. Another thing I found were these like sign wood signs and they had the metal version as well which is a little bigger so I'm not sure I was thinking of doing like my address on the front um, the number and the street and then putting it on my front door so I'm not sure if I'll do the wood or the metal I think I'm leaning towards the metal though because I feel like that one might last longer and even if it rusted and patinaed it would probably look really cool so I also found this wood piece which I think they've had before um, and I think it had hangers but this is just a plain like there's no hanger on this so I just liked it and you could paint all kinds of stuff on here and do a sign or just whatever you want Um, another thing I found at checkout was this screen cleaning set. Great for cleaning TVs, laptops, cameras, and phones. It even comes with the screen screen cleaning spray. So it's a two set. You get this cloth and you get the spray, which is pretty cute. You could keep this in your purse. And um, for $1.25, that's pretty cool. That'd be a neat gift for someone too. And I liked the tie-dye. They also had um, other things. They had like a screen cleaning can, um, set. Like it came with the cloths that you throw away. But this is reusable. But it also had this on, on the uh, package as, as the design. So really cute. Um, check it out because hopefully, you know, whether you prefer to be able to throw them away or have something reusable, which is my preference, that you have the option <laughs> okay let's see um another thing i found were these small tubs in gray they had like pink they had other colors but i picked up just like the light gray thought it was good um great for like little random things um if you're sorting things or just you know need a small bucket for something these are great Okay. Ooh. All right. Another really exciting find, which I know they had last year, but I only found one and only one, and it was in this color. But they had the pink and the green. I know because I looked on the website. But I was able to find all three at one of my stores. And another store had two of the three, which I believe were these two. So, yeah, these are really cute. They're ceramic. Um, I love these. <laughs> They're so cute. So if you're looking for some gnome things, um, yeah, I found these this week. I actually found them yesterday I found them yesterday and today so yeah 
Um, another thing is a repeat item, but I don't think I've ever hauled it because I don't think I was doing YouTube at that point. So I found another one of these like clapboards and these are really cool. Like if you just want to fill in, if you're doing a, a movie night or even if you just wanted to gift somebody um, something like this. Um, I'm working on my backdrop in my craft room, so I may display this um, with like my name and stuff using the Cricut, um, but you can write it in with ch chalk, whatever you want. Um, it would be really fun for a party because everyone could fill out their own thing and even like take a picture with it like that, um, like at a photo booth or something. That would be cute. So yeah, really cute pickup. Um, if you saw my last video, I did Dollar Tree re reviews and I reviewed these granola with the peanut butter and I found some with like raisins in it this time. Not a fan of raisins, so I didn't pick it up, but I do love this one with the um, peanut butter. Um, really good. And I want to open it. I'm dying to open it to see if there are any peanut butter chips because the last couple of bags I opened did not. So I'm just curious. And for some reason, this doesn't want to rip open. Maybe that's a good sign. Hmm. Yeah, so on first, first inspection, I'm not seeing the chips. Which is a disappointment, so. But, you know, it still tastes the same, so... You know, the chip, the peanut butter taste is in there. It's just not in chip form, unfortunately. But this is still very good. And if you're looking for granola, this is, um, in my opinion, this is really good. Okay. Um, I found another Easter sign in the pink and white buffalo check. Really cute. It says... Bunny Tail Farms, open nine to five, locally grown, farm fresh eggs and produce, established 1925. Oh my gosh, this sign is so cute. I love this. Um, I found pink tie dye fabric, which is really cool. I'd actually never seen that before. I've seen other tie-dye at Dollar Tree, but not the pink. So this is really pretty. So I picked that up as well. Um, I picked up more gem stickers. These kind of remind me of tiara, little tiny tiaras. And they had other colors, um, but I got the pink. Really pretty. Really cute as a border, or if you wanted to do little tiny tiaras, you could cut these up individually and do do that as well. Okay. I picked up more of these Salt Range Himalayan pink salt lip balms, and if you saw my last video, you saw that these are my absolute favorite lip balms. And if you see these, you should absolutely pick these up for, because for a dollar twenty-five, you get two. And honestly, I think it's the best one I've tried at Dollar Tree so far. So good pickup. Um, okay, not new. Well, actually, I think these are not new, the little trucks. They're like Easter eggs. They call them Easter eggs, but they're little trucks. <laughs> and they have like the whole rainbow, which is cute. I can see, you know, DIYing these and like put putting them on a tear tray. That would be really fun. I would probably try that, especially because you have all different colors. Like you could do this one for St. Patty's Day. Um, maybe this one as a lemon truck. Like, yeah, you're only limited by your imagination. You could paint these. Um, yeah, you could have a whole lot of fun with these. 
um, another thing that I think is new, I'm not sure, I don't remember seeing these before, are the Legos. And they, again, they're calling them Easter eggs, but they're containers. And they're Legos looking. Well, I should say building blocks because Lego's a brand. But yeah, these are really cute. And the other side has the holes. So if you stack them, you could have a whole lot of fun with these. So these could be fun for like parties, party favors. Um, um, yeah. <laughs> um, having like a centerpiece. If you have centerpiece, you could like, you know, make a little design or display with them. These would be cute. And they open up so you could store things in here as well if you're really into Legos and just want a small container. This would be really fun. Okay. Moving on. <laughs> I have... I still have a lot more. <laughs> um, okay, so I found these rub-on transfers and they're like spring themed, but they're really pretty. Look how pretty those are. You got bicycle, flowers, butterfly, little words. Ah, oh, so pretty. Those are pretty. I mean, this bicycle is so cool. Yeah. And then another item that is not new are sort of these like envelope things but they're iridescent and they come in colors and they have a snap. These are great. Like you can put receipts in here. You can do all kinds of stuff. Um, so they have the pink and this like teal color. They had a blue color, which I did not get, but that was cause it was so close to the teal and I really liked the teal. Um, and then they had just like this clear with the iridescent. So, so pretty. Yeah. So I like to, keep receipts in these like in my card and stuff too like especially things that I might need um, an envelope for and you could put photos in these there's lots of things you could do with these so good find um oh wow <laughs> I am not done <laughs> not anywhere close all right I've been waiting for Dollar Tree to kind of wow me and I haven't really found like those items yet um, until today because I kind of did find some cool stuff. I've been looking for this um, for quite a while and it's their wall stickers but this particular one is the one that I've been looking for and I haven't been able to find and I found it today. It says our family's gathering place sit long talk much and laugh often and um, if you saw me haul a lot of like the Valentine's Day long signs, um, well, they're long this way, <laughs> but I, I think I want to make like um, something for our deck. I want to kind of get into decorating our outdoors more. So I want to make something with this. And I thought that would be cute. We'll put some Mod Podge, stick it down, Mod Podge over it, and voila, <laughs> you have a porch or a um, deck sign. Very cute. But you could also do it for your living room and stuff like that. Um, another thing I found, again, which I honestly was surprised I found, um, because I had these a while back, and one of the stores I had still had them were these Buffalo Check placemats. And these are amazing. I love these. Um, I put two together and made a runner for my coffee table. Um, I saw, I've seen people make signs with these, like there's so many uses. So I picked up a couple more, even if you just were having like a gathering and you wanted to have some placemats, these are nice. They're fabric. You can make pillows with these. I mean, there's a ton of things you can do with these. So if you see them, you should definitely pick some up. Um, another item I found, which is not new, it's the silicone travel straw. And it comes with the straw, the case, and the little um, brush to clean the straw out, which I thought was really cute. Something you could just keep, you know, in your lunch bag or in your car in case you need a straw, which is very good. So, glad I found that. 
Um, another thing I found, just kind of surprised that I found was this um, USB wall charger from iPlanet. And I'm not exactly sure where this was from originally, but I feel like the packaging reminds me of Walmart. And I could be totally wrong, but I thought that this would probably be a little bit better than your traditional like Dollar Tree um, wall chargers. So, or yeah, wall charge, USB wall chargers, what they're calling it. So yeah. So if you already have the USB and you're always constantly looking for these, or if you have just a regular like outlet and you want to make it USB, this would be a good pickup for that. Let's see. Um, another thing I found was, I love their glasses and things sometimes. They have some really good ones. And this one says, live every moment, laugh every day, love with all your heart. I don't know how well you can see that, but I thought it would be fun to like paint the inside and turn it into a vase with some florals. That'd be cute. Um, okay, another shocking find was this selfie ring light. I mean, I've been pricing these out on Amazon and they were like $14. I mean, yes, they had coupons, but this recharges and then you have a portable selfie light, which is really cool and I'm excited to try. Um, they had pink, they had black. They might have had other colors, but of course I saw the pink and I had to have it. Um, and th another thing I saw were the metal words back from fall it has the fall label from Crafters Square and it says thankful harvest and welcome. Yeah, so I picked those up. I think the welcome is kind of like good for year round. So personally for me, this was worth picking up. All right. Uh, let's see. What else do I have? Oh, there is so much more. <laughs> it's crazy. All right. Um, I picked up another one of these pill boxes. I love these. I put a clear tape over the lettering so that it doesn't fade because I've noticed with Dollar Tree ones, they, you know, as they age, they get they get peeled off but with using some tape it it's stayed on very well i've had no issues so um i picked up another one eventually i want to have four so i can like do a whole month in advance so this is my third one and um so yeah i picked up another one for that purpose it'll just make it easier i don't have to fill it you know every week and stuff all right more signs. <laughs> More signs. Um, okay, this was something they did last year, but they brought it out again. It's the Cottontail Farms, and they had a blue truck, but I got a, I got the pink truck. I think the blue one has the bunny with the carrots, but this has the Easter eggs, which I liked. Really cute. I like that. Um, another sign I found, I, saw, I showed you the pink and white um, buffalo check and they also had black and white buffalo check. I think they had blue and white too, I think, I'm pretty sure, um, but don't quote me on that. But I really liked the black and white. I'm doing a lot of black and white this year. Um, basically for Easter, I'm kind of like the black, white and pink. So yeah, <laughs> love this. I might use the pink one in my, um, so I have a door leading to my craft room. I may, may use it for that. Um, another thing I found was another, um, one of these juncture multi-purpose bandanas and it's just a simple gray. It's really soft. Oh, I wish I could, you could feel it. 
but it has all of these different uses. And um, I work in the healthcare industry, so um, I need to wear um, I need to wear a mask. Uh, so I thought this would be cool though, just even to if I was out and about and I just wanted like a little scarf or a headband or whatever. I mean, this has so many uses. It doesn't just have to be a scarf, so I kind of like it. All right, um, this is not new. They've had these before, but I absolutely love these planters. They're so beautiful. And I wanna make some topiaries, like mini ones. Um, they're very expensive. And I was even thinking of making like the spiral topiaries and I was pricing them out and they're crazy expensive. It doesn't matter where you get them. So I got some planters um, for that purpose. It even, these even come with like the drainage um, things that go on the bottom. Now, I probably won't need them for that, but yeah, it does come with them. So if, if you're looking for something that you can actually um, plant in, these would work as well. They're plastic and I love, I love the little design and the light gray color. It just looks so pretty. So pick those up. Um, let's see. I also picked up another one of these pencil cases. But again, like I said, there are like a lot of loose little things in my console and I'd like to really organize my car a little bit better. So I picked these up. Hopefully I'll be able to use them for that. But if not, they'll probably be used for... Um, craft supplies. But I just really liked the colors and the design on this, so pick that up. All right, sorry, I keep sliding off my chair. <sighs> it's um, it's not very flat. It's very like padded, and I don't sit on it very much, so it, it's like not flat at all. It's very rounded. Sorry, I did not mean to bump you guys. Okay, so I'm trying to organize some of this a little bit just so it's not so random. But the next thing I found were these garden sticks. And this truck says Happy Easter, it has the gnome. So cute. And it's small, it's pretty small, it's not big. But I have a little wreath in my kitchen, so one of these might end up in there. I'm pretty sure that it will. Um, and then they have the Hello Spring. I love this. Oh my gosh, I wish I got more of these, actually. If, you, if you're asking me. Um, oh my gosh, this is so cute. So you have <laughs> two different ones. Oh, these are cute. And I usually just remove the um, stakes. Now it looks like they've actually improved on this because there's like a welded piece protecting it. But honestly, you could take these off and then repurpose these for crafts, which is what I prefer. Um, it even has like a hook at the top. So like if you wanted to hook it into a wreath, you could absolutely do that easily. So yeah, great pickup. You see these, and I almost missed them because they were so small, and they were like in this little tiny spot in the corner. So yeah, keep your eyes open because those are really cool. Um, another thing I found with them were the little gnomes, and I only found these two, this, the lavender and the pink. The lavender one has the egg, this one has the carrot really cute. I mean, even as magnets on your fridge, these would be adorable. <laughs> adorable. So I may do that. <laughs> All right. Another thing, I know this isn't new, but I think I passed on it in, in the past, um, but I just really liked it. 
and I thought, how cute would this be on your hot cocoa bar? So, I mean, obviously, I'll probably keep this for winter time, but this is so cute, and it has the little light, hot cocoa um, with marshmallows served here. I mean, it's got the little light. I mean, it's done. You can put it on a tear tray, and you're done. <laughs> so cute. I love this. I might even suggest maybe putting a little buffalo check bow right there, just to tie it in with your decor. But super cute find. All right. Ooh, I think we're in the home stretch. I hope we are. All right. So Dollar Tree has a lot of contact paper. If you haven't seen it before, I have this black and white floral, which I love um, and I've done crafts with. And if you haven't checked out my super simple Easter egg um, decor sign, it and check it out because in there you will find that um, contact paper that I'm referring to is what I used but in that section I found this damask pattern damask damask I don't know how you say it but I absolutely love it it's so Victorian it's black and white it's totally me anyone that knows me knows this is like totally me so I know I'm going to be using this in my craft room, probably in other DIYs, all kinds of stuff, because this is perfection in my opinion. So I picked up like four. <laughs> I only found this at one of my stores, but um, I will say it looked pretty well stocked up in there, and they had other designs that I hadn't seen before, so maybe this is a new design that they're starting to put out, and I really, really hope that's true, because this is Um, another thing I found were these galvanized tins for Easter. Super cute. You got the blue truck. It says, Happy Easter. Join the egg hunt in the, on that one. And then there's the pink truck. Uh, Easter bunny carrot garden pick patch. No. Pink pick. Fresh daily and it's got carrots. That writing is super small, it's impossible to read unless you have really good eyes. Well, not impossible because I was able to read it with my glasses. <laughs> okay. Something that is not new, but they've put out again, are these gold eggs really cute. I like them in the carton. Super cute. So, those up. Um, I also found this flexible stencil, which I don't, I'm pretty sure is not new, but it had all these, like, different patterns on it. And I just thought it would be fun to have on hand in case there was something I wanted to create or make. So really cute. What else do I have? What else? What else? Okay. Not new, but I've bought it before and I really like it. Is this LA is totally awesome all purpose cleanser and degreaser spot remover in cherry blossom. It smells good, it works well. Totally recommend picking this up. I mean, I think most of the LA's Totally Awesome brand is pretty amazing, so I would suggest it if you're interested in finding some cleaner. I mean, I know everything's going up, so if you can find a cleaner for $1.25, I'd say pick it up. It's pretty good size. It comes with a sprayer, and I mean, it's 32 fluid ounces, like that's pretty big. That'll last. I haven't even gone through the last one I bought, so yeah. Alright. Found more succulents, and I have a brown thumb, so <laughs> I thought that was cool. 
and I got that one, and I got this one, and I got this like lavender one. Now this one has the pot, but these two do not. Um, but I, I just thought they were so cool. And I have little um, planters that um, don't have anything. So <laughs> these would be cute to stick in there. All right, another item I found were these Sea Minerals and Blue Iris Liquid Hand Soap. And it's in this like amber color and it's so pretty. And um, yeah, I just thought that was a neat, like a neat bottle. A neat bottle, a neat, neat little high-end looking um, hand soap. So yeah, really cool. All right. Almost done, I promise. I have three more items. All right, the next two are these garlands. And I love the Easter Bunny one. It's black and white buffalo check, really cute. And then I found this one that has the bunnies um, and the carrots. And actually I'll open it because this one's the same. And I think they had other ones too, so if, um, I think they had other options too, but these are the two that I liked, so I picked those up. But yeah, I ha they have carrot, bunny, carrot, bunny. I kind of like that they did the pastel. I think they did, they made the right choice. Um, lavender bunny and then carrot. So these are really cute, actually. I've seen high-end um, garlands like this. Um, they have the burlap in the back, but like you could totally deconstruct this and do the same thing. Um, this would be really nice to um, to craft with. But even just even if you just want to leave it as is, it's beautiful, absolutely beautiful. And they're stapled in the back, so if you take them apart. Um, yeah, you won't ruin your twine and, um, you, you only damage the back if anything. So it'd be totally fine. Okay. I'm sorry this video was like super, super long, but I, I can't even believe how many items I found. I mean, there was more I probably could have showed you. Um, but yeah, it's crazy how many awesome items I found this week. Um, but the last item, I was like, what in the world? Oh, the cool turtle. These things you put under your mask so you have circulation. Comfortable, speak clearly, no more smudged makeup, washable. Like, this is cool. And for $1.25, you don't just get one. You get six. What? Oh my gosh. Now I know a lot of places are lifting the um, masks and a lot of people are moving away from that, which is probably why Dollar Tree got these. These are probably overstock, right? But if you're in the health industry or if you're, um, if you're, you know, immunocompromised or if you you know, you have elderly parents and you just feel safer for right now, or you're caring for someone who's elderly, um, or just, you know, there's probably a hundred different reasons why you are still wearing a mask, me included, so I feel you. Um, yeah, this is great. I mean, I can't wait to try these. I hope they work because for $1.25, this is amazing. And I was tempted to get more, but I was like, mm, I'm already getting six. Like, yeah. And yeah, I don't want to go crazy. But this, I I mean, wow. I could see them carrying one for $1.25, but six? What? I can't believe it. 
So anyway, that is my huge Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree haul. I hope you enjoyed it. I know it was a little long, but if you stuck through, please hit that like, subscribe, and comment down below. And um, if you are new, please consider subscribing. I could really use all of the subscribers that I can get. Um, and please share, try to get people to watch. That would be so amazing. I would really appreciate it. Um, and if you um, have been commenting, you know who you are. I love you all. Um, thank you so much for commenting, sticking with me, and being so kind. I love it. I love you. Um, please continue doing what you do because you always put a smile on my face. And I will catch you on the next one. Bye, guys. Thank you.